morning, good morning. So one more sleep and then we're into 2024. Now my advice for you in 2024 is something that I heard the great Mel Robbins say yesterday. And that is that when you go into the new year, you should think about doing less instead of doing more. You know, a lot of us make the mistake that when we go into a new year, we decide, well, I need to do more exercise. I need to do more work. I need to get on more social media platforms. I need to buy more books. I need to buy more products. And it's all more, more, more. And you will find that when you take on more, it's going to just, you might be able to stick with it for maybe a week or two. But then after that, you're just going to have too much work on your plate and you're just going to drop out. You're not going to exercise as much. You're not going to read all the books that you're buying. You're not going to use all the products. You're not going to, you know, follow all the people on social media, whatever. So 2024 for you should be the year that you actually do less. It's where you narrow down. It's where maybe if you are on maybe a lot of email lists that you should start unsubscribing. You know, have a look at the inbox this past 12 months. Who has been really useful to you and who has been just a waste of time sending you just sales letter after sales letter after sales letter. Maybe it's time to unsubscribe from those people and follow the people who are the most helpful to you. Again, on social media. I'm sure there's probably a lot of accounts you're following right now. Of those accounts, who have been the most useful to you? Again, unsubscribe from that. So at least you're not getting as much content coming to you as you were in 2023. You know, I think a lot of people, the biggest problem when it comes to building online businesses or just having any success online is that they have so much content coming from everywhere and so many people looking for their attention that you just get distracted and they don't focus on them and their business. So by narrowing down the amount of people you are actually going to come in contact with, it will leave you, you know, a lot of space for your own thinking and for you to be less distracted. You know, focus on the people who are helping you right now. So give that some thought when you're heading into 2024. You know, your biggest problem right now is probably going to take on more work. What you need to do is you need to look at what was working in 2023. Take those things that worked in 2023 and then take them into 2024 and then expand on those. Have a lovely day. Bye bye.